Hey, what's happening, ladies and gentlemen? Stephen Davidson here. It's shape video. I've got about see here six days worth of beer growth, give or take. So, and it's itching bad, so it's got to go. So let's get started. Go prep my face off camera with Barber Soul. 1919 Leatherless Shave Cream, the usual suspect. I've had it soaking. I went back to my ceramic cup. The ceramic cup holds the heat better and longer. And I've got my Maggard Razor's Blue Swirl. Gray Timberwolf 24 millimeter synthetic knot. It's been soaking. I'm gonna get the, my mustache area with my thorn. And I've got a feather blade in there. Third shave on it. And for the rest of my face, I'm going to be using my Marcor 37C slant with a fresh feather blade in there. And to start today's party, we'll go with Boonda Beard Soaps from South Africa. And this is their Sanga Symphony set. Fantastic soap. And I'm going to finish it off with... Aqua Velva Classic Ice Blue Aftershave. Man, I love this stuff. Alright, I'm going to shut her down and get prepped. And when I come back, it should be fully lathered up and ready to go. So, stand by. I will be right back, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, I'm back. Yogurt, anyone? You can go get no better than that. And this lather's nice and hot. So that's fantastic. All right, now for the thorn on the mustache area. And third shave on a, well, third shave on a feather blade. This is a total mess. I'll have to dry that off. <laughs> Alright, relief is here. I could, repeat, could get my uh, mustache here with the slant. Enough for it. Freshly corked. So the blade up in there. But. If I do, I just about guarantee you, you're going to see some serious cuts there at Weeper. It's just pretty efficient razor. Now, I got the German 37 Torsion Noble from Razor Rock, which is it's almost similar to this. Only difference is it's a three piece and this is a two piece and the handle's about that much longer. So yeah, but other than that, it's still the same um type of head. A slant slices while your regular just chops it off. This is the second one of these I've had, by the way. My first one I got from Geo Fatboy. I think I got this one from Maggard Razors. My first one I got from Geo Fatboy lasted about three years. I 
Very fine razor. Very fine razor. Would I recommend it for a beginner? Not really. This is really good at getting my trouble spots too. Very, very, oh yes, very nice first pass. And I believe the thorn got it for, closer than the slant would have. Wow. All right, let's rip them. Quick rip. Got cut up on all the shave videos. It was cool seeing Ken Surfs use the fine accoutrements of Barber Blue and Razor Rock Blue Barber Shop soap and uh, aftershave. It's really cool seeing that. Paul has been doing real good with his head shaves and whatnot. He got a real good one yesterday. Did nick himself a little bit right in here, but other than that, it's cool. Let's see, Chuck has been using a razor rock hawk and shaved off his mustache with it. Got himself a little bit right there. I've got the first version that, ever, that was ever released, but they have since changed it two times since the version I've got. And here lately, to be honest, I've been checking out the Blacklands Vector single edge. And I also cut Matt Pesarsic's video over at the Razor Emporium. Parker, a razor company, who's been around for 50 years now, over 50 years now, does a lot in the straight razor community as well. Uh, he, uh, they just released a brand new single edge that uses a half D blade. So that's cool. Seems like single edges that use a half D blades become it. Across the grain. Very, 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 very nice. This is going to be a good shade right here, boys and girls. And I've been thinking about using this slant all week. Beautiful. Fantastic. Fantastic. Oh wow, one more pass and I'm done. Ready, let's see what we got here. Fantastic, fantastic. Pass. Coffee mug one is doing great this morning. I 
the sound on this thing of symphony is kind of uh, like a woodsy, aromatic woodsy type scent, but uh, it pairs extremely well with aqua velvet for some reason. So this is the other one that Ken sent me. And the bath bar was amazing. Still working on it. That bath bar lasted a long time. All right, money pass. But first, with the thorn. I think I'll get my underneath my lip too. That's the secret to getting a good shave, ladies and gentlemen. Don't be afraid to grab a different razor for a different area. A lot of people, oh, you shouldn't do that, blah, blah, blah. Why shouldn't I? I got a close shave and I'm not cut. And it's comfortable. Money pass with the 37 C slant. And the slant, I'll tell you something else too. The slant is extremely good for curved surfaces. Used to know a couple guys in the community. I ain't heard nothing about them for years. I don't forget their names, to be honest. But they used to shave their heads with these. Poor Paul, he's been, uh, over to shave a fox's den, the shaving fox. He's been having a tough time getting a top cap for his car of razor. Uh, Paul, you might want to check out uh, Razor Emporium. They carry spare parts and they do full blown restoration services and tune ups. So if you got an old razor you need tuning up, or if you want to totally restore it, talk to Matt Pesarsic over at Razor Emporium. And I'm going to, oh wow, I'm going to call that good, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to shut her down and clean up, and when we come back, we'll recap and finish her off. So, stand by, I will be right back, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, I'm back. Look at that, man. I am baby butts, man. You ain't going to get no better than that. And no leaks. I'm going to hit the stick with that one for a while but i tell you what switching to the feather blades made a world of difference in corking it does not dull the blade when you cork one what it does do is it takes the uh the coating off the blade that they spray on at the factory and allows the blade to cut so that being said three passes with a slant and your bbs but yeah, I'm happy with it. So let's recap. I prepped my face off camera with Barbasol 1919 Latherless Shave Cream. Good stuff. I went with my Maggot Razors Blue Swirl Gray Timber Wolf 24mm Synthetic Knot. 
I did my mustache area with the thorn by Leaf Shave, and it was the third shave on a feather blade. I went with the Marcor 37C Slant, fresh feather blade in there that was court. And the star of the day's party was Boonda Beer Soap got me out of South Africa. And this was the Sanga Symphony set. And we're going to finish it off right now with some Aqua Velva Classic Ice Blue Aftershave. Man, I love this stuff. Very soothing and it does not break me out. Oh man, does that feel good. Not much of a burn, but a little bit. I don't know if you can hear that or not, but I'm squeaky. I love shaves like this, where I don't get cut and I'm real close. Almost as close as a cart. Double does it. Why not? Feeling real good. Smelling real good. Mm. All right. Fantastic as usual. All right, we're going to come out good. Thank you for watching, and I will see you guys again here soon. Take care. God bless. Later.